In this video, we're going to show you how to set up a website tab. You can display any external website page within a tab on your app. First, you need to log in with the username and password that you were provided. Once you are logged in, click on Add New Tab. Give the tab a title. Then from the drop-down menu, select Website Tab. Then you can select an icon and click on Save Changes. You will see the tab has been added to the list. You can move this tab to any location on the app by clicking on the crosshairs and dragging. You can preview the tab in our App Previewer. You will see the tab here, but we have not added a URL just yet. Now we are going to add a URL to the tab we just created. Click on the next step, which is Content. Then click on the tab you just created. It will show you here that you have zero websites added. So let's add a new web view. Name the web view. Then enter the URL that you're going to display. A copy and then paste it into this box right here. If you are collecting donations for your organization, you will need to check this box right here. This is a requirement directly from Apple. This will open the page outside of the app in the phone's browser. If the URL does not contain donations, you can leave this unchecked. You can also upload a custom thumbnail if you are going to add multiple web views. The thumbnail should be 140 by 140 pixels. Then save changes. Now you will see your web view that you just added here on the list. You can preview this in the App Previewer. And you'll notice here that since we have only added one web view, that page will display once you click on the tab. Now let's add a second web view. Enter the web view title, and then again, copy and paste the URL of the page you would like to display. Then click Save Changes. Now you have two web views listed. You can move these by clicking on the crosshairs and dragging. You can also edit or delete your web views. If you would like a navigation bar to show inside the app to be able to navigate between the pages of the website views that you are displaying, you can check this box right here and then click Update Settings. Let's take a look now at how this looks on our App Previewer. Now you can see the two web views that we've created. Thanks for watching.